A new series called 7th on the 7th in the 7th month of us doing YouTube. Did I plan that? Well, I'll take credit for it anyways. But yes, 7th on the 7th. In lamest terms, it is going to be our channel update video like I used to do back in my streaming days. But this one's going to have a little more finesse to it. It's 7 topics on the 7th of each month. They're going to be varying topics. A lot of times you'll see the same ones. And I'm not going to be doing this. I'm only doing it because, well, it's our first one. You need to know what's going on. So today we'll talk the future of the channel. We'll talk what the heck's going to be happening in only a week because there's going to be a big change coming. And, uh, well, we will be touching on support, which is something I really don't ever do and will probably only do in these types of videos. But without further ado, let's get to it. Time to talk the month before. July was a totally, totally fine month, folks. It really was. I mean, it was nothing compared to May or June, and we'll get to that. But in the month of July, we got 24 videos out. 17 videos in Shipwrecked, 6 videos in Don't Start Together, and only one, what I'm calling, other video. Which was the microphone review video from a couple weeks back. But 17 videos in Shipwrecked alone, and we still had the production that we had? I'll take it. In those 24 videos alone, we had over 1,053,000 views. Just those. Not even the entire month. The entire month was 2.6 million. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> doing pretty darn well there, I would say. And yes, if you are curious, I hate talking this kind of stuff. We did go away with a nice chunk of change. We did. But it was nothing compared to June. June, for whatever reason, everybody, was absolutely crazy. If I could share with you the numbers from June, I, like, like, I wish I would have had one of this idea to do this last month because holy moly, June was just ridiculous. We had 6,000 subs, new subs in July, a little bit over that, which is great. Welcome all the new faces, which is pretty much all of you. I'm sure you guys are seeing my face for the first time, hearing me for the first time, outside of guide stuff. So very much welcome. But 6,000 subs is nothing compared to what we got in May and June. And this is kind of going to lead us into our next topic here. Real talk. What is the longevity of Don't Starve? Don't Starve Together, Don't Starve Hamlet, Shipwreck, that sort of thing. Hold up. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry. Don't Starve isn't going anywhere. In fact, I have all the plans in the world to continue producing Don't Starve content in Hamlet, Shipwreck, Solo, Don't Starve Together, whatever it happens to be, in guides and in Let's Plays, because yes, they are coming. But here's the deal. We are at a peak. You guys maybe not really seeing it, but I can because I got all the numbers. May, April, May, and June, that chunk is when we did most of our growth in Don't Starve and in that category sort of deal. We had a little shake up here and there. We'll talk about that maybe later. But honestly, though, is there are there still eyes on Don't Starve and is there still potential there? Absolutely. And again, it's not going anywhere. Don't worry. It's not going anywhere. But Don't Starve is not that big of a game, folks. It, it isn't. You know, and I can't have success beyond what we are seeing if I don't branch out from different games. So, let's talk The Road Ahead. Would you look at that? The title of this next segment is The Road Ahead. But I gotta say this, folks. A lot of you don't know that this is not my job. In fact, I don't even consider it halfway a job, to be honest with you. I go back to work, real work, in a week's time. Literally a week from today, I am back at work for nine months straight. So, yeah, the upload schedule that you guys have gotten used to is not going to be a thing. You guys have been getting a little spoiled by me lately. For those who have been around at the tail end of last year, you know that I was getting like a video every two, three days instead of like a video daily. For right now, let's talk filling whatever time I'm going to have. And thus comes the introduction of Let's Plays. And yes, the two I kind of have a feeling on starting first are going to be Oxygen Not Included and Don't Starve Hamlet. Both of which are games I've been wanting to play and have barely played and need to get back to. So what better to learn them in order to, you know, make guides in them <laughs> uh, than Let's Plays. So 
there you go. But I also want to call back to that other one video I mentioned, the microphone video. Those types of videos, these types of videos, I need to do more of them. Why? I want to. I, I don't know. I like these sort of things. I just put on the camera, I point it at me, and I talk. And then I edit out what I don't want to see, you know, or what you guys might not want to see. I like these types of videos. For months, you guys have only heard my voice. And very little of you have seen me. And that's not necessarily great, in my opinion. We're here together. We're here to grow a channel and a community together. But if you don't see the person who is fronting all that, then is it really meaningful at all? So that's why I want to do more of these things. So I, I got to push myself to do it. Like I had so many things. Like I could have reacted to many movie trailers. I could have reacted to gaming stuff. I got to do it. You know, even if it's not going to do well view wise, I got to do it. And that's kind of a thing here with the road ahead. I got to break out of this shell. What I'm doing is working. It's working very well. But again, with the peak thing and where we stand, I got to get past that. I, I just got to walk past it. I got to do it. Even if I'm nervous to do it, even if I'm anxious, if I know it's not going to do well, just do it. Just get content out there. Get content out there. It's as simple as that. But let's talk something that I don't really like talking about, but I'm going to do it anyway. So how can you support the channel? Well, I'm going to start off by saying one thing, and it's the most important thing. Watching and sharing our videos is the best thing that anybody can do. Just do it. You know, tell your friends this, that, the other. That is the best thing anybody can do to help any channel, not even just mine. However, that being said, from the get-go, even before I started streaming over four years ago, I still believe that Patreon is the best tool I have to enable growth and for you guys to be able to have significant change on this channel. For example... Head to the page and you'll be scrolling for a while as we'll have simple $1 pledges that can go an absolutely long way. So thank you to those who ever choose that. Pledges that see me adding you on social media platforms, even gaming consoles like Xbox, Switch, all that sort of stuff. You can even unlock community play dates that we can play a variety of games in now and then. We got fun little pledge wars against the sixes and the sevens that see exclusive roles in discords, rewards outside of servers like live streams or giveaways, and just be in front of a little gag that I started back in my streaming days that people seem to enjoy. We got numerous pledges that will see your name on the wall of thanks, the thing that is at the end of every single one of my videos. So please take a look as the many other rewards come with those. Like exclusive behind the scenes, you get video premieres hours if not days before any of the other plebs see them. You can even get personal video messages from yours truly monthly and just so much more. But there is something new that maybe you don't even know about yet because, again, I don't talk about it because I hate talking about it. You notice that join button on the channel? Well, that's the thing that you need to click on if you want to learn more about these said channel memberships I'm yapping on about. So if you click on it, you'll currently see that we have four starting at $2 a month. And I honestly didn't know you were able to make levels until about a week and a half ago. So I went ahead and did it. And for now, we got more exclusive roles no matter which one you pledge at. We got exclusive posts, again, no matter which one you pledge at. We can get official and exclusive live streams with emojis and little badges too, loyalty badges. This is kind of like Twitch does. Premieres on videos and even videos potentially exclusive to members down the line. I mean, if you want any more, this is it. Here's something I bet you didn't expect, live streaming, but as of right now, literally zero plans are going back. Uh, I would like to at some point, but I think I'm going to wait until some other games are out, some faster paced games are out, because if I go back to it now, I am not going to be up to speed per se. I have everything already ready. I mean, I streamed for four years, seven days a week. I know how to stream. Personally, I enjoyed streaming. I love the live interaction. I just love the interaction with the audience. That's what it's all about. But four days a week, uh, four days a week, four years, seven days a week, I just got tired of it. I just got tired of it, folks. I couldn't take it anymore. So you know what? I'm just going to stand here and say that, yes, there's hope for it, but I would not expect it anytime soon. But speaking of hope, 
what are Beard's goals for the remainder and honestly just for this month? Well, I'm going to be honest with you. As a person, I don't really set goals for myself. So as an extension of that, I don't really set goals for the channel because this is going to kind of sound a little whatever, but I don't really care about it as much as I once did. Back in my streaming days, you know, I was all into it, man. I, I, I did enjoy it, all that stuff, and I did set goals. You know, I wanted to hit 30 subs, never got there. I wanted to maintain a good audience, which sometimes I did, other times I didn't. So it was just like, I never, ever reached, I didn't. I never, ever reached the single goal I had on Twitch. So it kind of just soured goals for me. So when I say I don't really care about it, that's what I mean. That being said, though, when I got off of work over two months ago now, uh, for a little break. Um, I said that I would strive for 40,000 subs before I went back. If you look at where we're at right now, we kind of crushed that. Who knows? By the time I get this video out, we might be over 50,000. And holy moly, that's amazing. Just my absolute heartfelt thanks to everybody out there pouring it all, all my love out to you. Unbelievable. I mean, unbelievable. Seven months. Seven months, people. That's how long we've been doing this. Just a little over a half a year. Uh, and 50,000 subs, 14 million video views. I'm okay with that, you know? I am okay with that. I am not here to just suddenly blow up. Because to be honest with you, I don't really want to. I mean, I am okay with the steady growth. If it happens, it happens. But I am just happy to create the content that I want to create and just, you know, interact with the people who enjoy it. I mean, that is where we stand. That is where I stand. I I'm grounded. I am humble. In fact, the folk I talk to about what I'm doing, about the success that I'm seeing, they're more excited about it than I am, to be honest. And that's not me being, you know, cold about it or not caring. It's the fact that I understand what this is. You know, I understand what not to get all into and worked up about and worry about because I've done it before. I think my time on Twitch, my four years on Twitch, is honestly the best thing that's ever happened. I, I gotta be honest. Even though it failed. Even though it did fail. I had success. I did. I'm something from fantastic much to be honest with you. But it coming down is what led me here today. Sitting here. You know, yeah, we're small. 50,000. People have grown faster. Don't get me wrong. But again, like I said, so what? <laughs> so what? You know, we're, we're us. We're our channel. Don't worry about other channels. And honestly, I'm talking to myself here. Folks, I am very thankful. This video is probably a little longer because it's the first one. Um, but anticipate a more straight to the point from here on out. This was just the first one, so on and so forth. We keep moving forward. Sometimes slow. Other times, like a whirlwind. But that's the name of the game there. You just never know, folks. You never know. So thank you to those who have watched this. Thank you to those who have been watching. Welcome, everybody. I mean, it's insane. The last time I did anything like this, nowhere near this. I mean, the last channel update I did was a streaming one. And that was, oh my gosh, who knows at this point. But there's so many new faces. This is my face. This is my voice. It's just, wow. Just, wow. Keep being yourself. Keep being ourselves. Do what we want to do. And we're in this together through it all. Always. Always, always, always. I can't wait to be doing more of these videos. I uh, can't wait to keep doing more stuff. We're about to roll past 50,000 subs. Wow. At our only seventh month of YouTube. And I am enjoying the company along the way. So thanks, everyone. I'll see you in the next one. Well wishes to you. Bye-bye.